R-V-B-N, The Rich Video Blog Network, home to weekly NFL predictions, great personality profiles, great professional wrestling video blogs, great sports video blogs, great entertainment video blogs, great MBTA video blogs, and tons more. Collection of my work goes back to June of 2014 on various social media websites. RVBN, the only video blog on the internet that, that matters. Time now is 7.29 in the evening, Bellwicker, Massachusetts, on Tuesday, April 4th, 2017. Still raining out, about 40 degrees. Cloudy tomorrow, more rain on Thursday. But next week, the southwest wind comes. Maybe record-breaking heat for this time of year next Tuesday or Wednesday keep you posted on that but it could change some news to report on the RVB news why do 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 it's official the green line extension has been the okay to start construction again and this is supposed to open up in 2021 new stations extending into Union Square Somerville and College Avenue in Method at the campus of Tufts University. That's going to be a big boom to some of all. This project should have been completed years and years ago. The Vegas Golden Knights have announced that their season tickets for 2017-2018 have been sold out. It's amazing. I think hockey's going to be a big hit in Vegas. And the Florida Panthers are going to fire their interim head coach, Tom Rove, at the end of the season. That's about it on news from the RVBN News. Why do, 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 be back in flash with my third and final video blog of the night. Top candidates for coach of the year in the NBA. Tomorrow on RVBN, only two video blogs for you. First video blog will be about WMTW meteorologist Sarah Long. And the second and final video blog of the night will be about top candidates for NBA Most Valuable Player. And coming next week, previews and predictions of the NBA and NHL playoffs. RVBN. Lots of great sports video blogs here. And look out, maybe within the next two weeks, look for a video blog to drop on the former toy store Child World. Will be good. I'm back. My third and final video blog subject tonight is about top contenders for the Red Auerbach Award, which is NBA Coach of the year. There are several contenders for NBA Coach of the Year, and probably one of the top contenders has to be Celtics head coach Brad Stevens. The Celtics uh, have the best record in the NBA's Eastern Conference this year. They're stepping it up each and this season. They're going to be a top three or four seed, and Brad Stevens should really get considered for Coach of the Year. Another top candidate for Coach of the Year in the NBA this year has to be Scott Brooks of the Washington Wizards. The Washington Wizards have won their first division title since 1979. Brad Beal and John Wall are a great tandem, and I think they're going to maybe challenge for the Eastern Conference Championship as well. Another top candidate for Coach of the Year in the NBA this year has to be Jason Kidd of the Milwaukee Bucks. The Bucks are in prime playoff positioning after last year missing the playoffs by a mile. Another top coaching candidate this year has to be Greg Popovich of the San Antonio Spurs. San Antonio each and every year um, goes high expectations because Tim Duncan retired and then Manuel Ginobili and T Tony Parker are getting old, but they have new players like Lamar Aldridge and Kawhi Leonard and 
Popovich has to be considered like a top candidate for culture of the, of the year. Another coaching candidate to look for this year in the NBA has to be uh, Mike D'Antoni from the Houston Rockets. The Rockets are having an stout, outstanding season on the upper half of the Western Conference playoff seeding as they were barely a playoff team last year. And another consideration for Coach of the Year in the NBA this year, Billy Donovan of the Oklahoma City Thunder. A lot of people would what we're predicting that Thunder would be kind of like a fringe playoff team at best, but they are, have the sixth best record in the Western Conference, mainly because of um, Russell Westbrook, but you have to consider um, Bill Billy Donovan's doing a great job coaching uh, Thunder this year, despite them losing Durant. And if I had to pick who the top three finalists for Coach of the Year of the NBA this year, Brad Stevens of the Boston Celtics, Mike Dan D'Antoni of the Houston Rockets, and Scott Brooks of the Washington Wizards. I think it's probably going to be Brad Stevens of the Boston Celtics winning Coach of the Year of the NBA this year. And that's about it on that. Be back tomorrow, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Google Plus with two more video blogs. Keep calm, everybody. I'm a Julie Button guy. Molly Wolf, Blood, WCC, Oxen has nice legs. Elizabeth Hutt, so, so stunning. She's the best. Amy Tweezy is awesome. Awesome Amy. Then Church of WK, I channel love New York. Such a rocking cool. That's got the best legs in New York City. Bob Bob Gibbs of ABC 11 has sweet side than accent. Best legs in Raleigh, North Carolina. And in the words, Sean, let you get out. See you later. Bye now.